to my channel so my name is Halima so on today I'm going to be doing a beginner friendly flawless foundation routine okay and um, few people have requested for this video so I thought I will squeeze squeeze it in today so yeah can't like stay tuned for the rest of the video so we're gonna start off with um, cleansing the face um, I've scrubbed my face this morning I've done all my you know mask and everything this morning so I'm just gonna basically gonna cleanse I always like to before I put my foundation I always like to like cleanse my face just to get rid of any residue of oil even though I've not put any sort of moisturizer or anything like that I just basically came out of the shower got dressed and decided to you know fume this today so yeah I'm gonna cleanse my face now tone my face and then I'll follow on with my moisturizer and things like that okay so what I'm gonna be using today is I'm gonna be using my Pipsy glow tonic I don't know if you guys can see there's so much light so yeah it's Pipsy glow tonic um, it's made of 5% glycogen acid so I'm gonna use this okay yeah I think it's better now so yeah that's the one I'm just gonna use a little bit just to you know Keep my face glowy for the rest of the morning so I just put a bit of that onto a cotton wool and we're gonna just use it oh it's nice and cool just use that just to you know cleanse the face and just, you know, just do that for a few seconds This is basically this just refresh the skin and get rid of any like I said any oil any build up or build up of oil and just get your skin ready for that um, foundation okay okay so once we finish um, toning the skin now we're gonna move on to a moisturizer so I normally put serum um by pepsi this is vitamin c so i normally put a bit of this before i put the rest of the stuff i'm gonna put on so i'll show you guys what they are um so just a little drop about three drops of my vitamin c pepsi serum just put that in the palm of my hand three drops and basically rub it together and then use it to massage my face just make sure I massage it in well. Just massage that for a few seconds. Just massage it. It should go around the eyes, you know, it's all part of your skin. Leave your chin. Okay, so once you've done that, now you're going to move on to, um, I always like to put my shea butter, so my shea butter is my moisturizer, um, although I have a combination skin, but I always like to put my shea butter, so I put this shea butter, but it smells really nice, so there it is, so I'm going to scribble a little bit, just that tiny, tiny bit, because shea butter is quite concentrated, so you don't want to be overdoing it. You know, just put, just dump it on your face and just use it to massage in. Just gives you that instant glow, as you can see. Then, once I'm done with that, then I go in, always like to put um, SPF um, when because now the sun is coming out. Basically, it's highly recommend that you put SPF on all the time, even when it's winter time, because that protects your skin from any radical damage and so on and so forth, not just from sunlight. So I'm going to put this Hello Care um, Color Gel Cream Browns SPF 50. 
So I'm just going to put a little bit of that before I put my foundation. This has a bit of colour in it. So I'm going to squeeze this little, that, that amount because I don't want too much, okay? Just a little bit. And basically just smoothing into your skin. That will protect your skin from any damage, environmental damage. So now the skin is all ready to basically um, accept the foundation. Okay, so now I'm going to put the primer. You always need a primer with every foundation. Um, if you put primer, primer is just basically gonna keep your foundation smooth. It's gonna keep your foundation on flawless, matte. Um, you know and gonna um, help your foundation to last basically all day so you need a primer with every foundation or every makeup routine okay so the primer that I'm gonna be used I'm gonna be using today is Maybelline face studio prime and it's pause minimizer primer I've used it this in a lot of the makeup tutorial that I've done it's my favorite so gonna use that you know everything you shake it a little bit just to make sure everything is all you know basically together so I just take that amount okay and I am going to rub it in and then we'll move on to the foundation routine so just make sure that it's everywhere okay so now we're going to Put the foundation on so the foundation that I'm going to be using today is basically L'Oreal True Match my favorite um, and it's super blendable um, foundation and this color is um, caramel golden topic yeah I've used this in some of the video that I've done I've used this it's really good you guys should get it um, I'm going to use it with this foundation brush with a square end um, yeah. So I've shaken it already, but always make sure you shake your foundation just to make sure everything is regulated inside, mix well. Okay, so I'm gonna squeeze some my forehead on the side, okay. and basically use this brush to blend that in. new beginner to makeup and you know like getting your foundation is quite can be quite challenging at times um, so always make sure you start off with kind of reasonable um, foundation and um, like drugstore I always use I always use drugstore I like I love drugstore foundation because I think um, it's cost less it's reasonable <laughs> does the job you know um, and basically yeah that's it it's just you know it's affordable so you always make sure you go for something that is affordable um, because you don't want to spend so much money especially when you have you don't know the specific shade so always make sure when you go to buy a foundation you always make sure you test it before buying it you know you don't want to buy it and when you get home you find out that it's not accurate you know This looks a bit light, however, it's my tone, it's my skin tone, and um, yeah, it's, I just need to blend it in well, and everything <laughs> else will fall into place. Make sure you concentrate on the chin area, because you don't want to have it. Um, you know, half foundation and everyone can tell that you've got like lines showing that you've got foundation on it. Just make sure you blend it in well. Side. Okay, 
so once you finish with the um, you know with the blending with your brush so now we're going to take our beauty blender and we're going to use the beauty blender to basically tap gently on your face this ensure that you know you get rid of any brush lines that occurred when you use the brush to blend the foundation in so this basically get rid of any brush line and um, that will be remain so you just gently tap that on on your face I mean if you want you can also wet it slightly so you just spray your fix um, you know fix, fix spray and just use that to gently tap onto your face okay so now we finish off um, with the blending using the real techniques um, beauty blender you can continue now to do highlights contouring and highlighting and then finish the rest of your face um, however I'm going to bring out a new tutorial um, specifically for beginners that I teach you about contouring and highlighting so um, watch out for this video it's hopefully gonna come out somewhere this week so watch out for that but for now I'm just gonna quickly do my eyebrow put a mascara on and do my lips and then put a, a fixing spray and then that's it for today okay so yeah okay so to finish everything off to run it run up you can just just use a bit of a powder um, I'm using this ES um, one powder from super drugs just use that to finish everything off and you know keep your foundation on the mat just gently blend that in just gonna take another small brush and I'm gonna use that one to get around the eye area make sure all this bit is blending with the foundation if you know what I mean basically ladies and gentlemen that's the end of the tutorial um, beginner friendly foundation routine so if you guys did enjoy this video all you need to do is give it a thumb up um, share it, subscribe, comment and basically that's it. I hope you guys enjoy this quick tutorial. Basically just a quick beginner friendly foundation routine. So thank you so much for watching. Bye bye for now.